This is a question we hear a lot, uh, and it, it harkens back to this idea that individuals are not necessarily equipped to deal with information about their health status. This is a very paternalistic viewpoint, I think, and, and to put it in context, uh, for many years, physicians uh, said that there's no way that uh, a woman could be trusted with a, a home pregnancy test, because uh, how could they possibly know what to do with the results? And they need uh, a, phys a physician to really oversee giving that information to the individual. Uh, I think we can all look back now and say that that was, was a ridiculous uh, mindset. We absolutely understand just how important it is to give individuals their own information about what's going on with their body, in that case about pregnancy. The same thing applies here. So I think that people can deal with the information appropriately. Uh, there can be a website set up, for example, where, where uh, public health individuals can get in touch and help people get in touch with a physician if they need it. And uh, maybe most importantly is people will still go about uh, uh, getting in touch with physicians if they're symptomatic. Nothing should change about that. If you feel sick, get in touch with your doctor. Uh, but I do believe that people can handle the information if they see that they might be transmitting virus. Uh, you know, I, I think that they can, they can understand what that means and, and hopefully that the instructions for use, for example, of the tests would come with websites and, uh, and information about what to do if you do turn positive, stay home, uh, call your physician if you're not feeling well. And very frequently in public health and in medicine, we assume that the average person uh, can't be held responsible to, to receive their own information. And I think that uh, in, in 2020, we've, we've started to move beyond that.